In this brief video, we will look at what is meant by standing deposit facility rate. It's a measure used by central bank to absorb excess liquidity from commercial banks. It's a quantitative measure used to control the level of money supply. This measure is being used to limit potential large fluctuations in interest rates and price level. Pause this video and write down these points for your reference. Stability Central bank's main objective is to maintain economic, price and financial system stability free from any fluctuations. In contrast, commercial bank's main objective is to make profit. Commercial banks accept deposits from the general public and loan it out to the borrowers. They charge high rate of interest from the borrowers but pay much less rate of interest to their depositors. The difference between the two rates of interest becomes the main source of profit to the commercial bank. By now, you will understand that commercial banks will not make any profit unless they loan it out. Loaning out money will increase the money supply and reduce the price of money, or in other words, the interest rates, which will further increase the demand for loans by the borrowers. Downfall of this scenario is that it will leave too much of money chasing too few goods, resulting in skyrocketing prices. In other words, inflation. In order to bring the right balance between the commercial bank's objective of profit and the central bank's objective of price and interest rate stability, central bank introduced standing deposit facility rate, where they accept excess money from commercial banks under the standing deposit facility and in return provide an interest rate. Prevailing standing deposit facility rate in Sri Lanka is 4.5%. Okay guys, so it's a wrap for today's lesson. Hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon to keep you notified.